I first wish to remind you that everything that you are is born from the Creator, a source that is labelless, nameless, formless, and in truth, cannot be described, and yet, throughout the entire universe of the Creator and your earthly reality. We sense and acknowledge expressions of the Creator in every moment, beautiful expressions, creative expressions. Each expression allows us to explore, to integrate with, and to understand the Creator more fully. We recognize ourselves as the Creator and our goal is to remember that oneness that we hold with the Creator as well as ourselves, as a source that is labelless, nameless, formless and in truth cannot be described. And yet, it is infinite, limitless, beautiful, powerful and holds the direction and intention for growth and evolution. This relationship you are looking for is the one you have with yourself. Whatever your mind tells you that you wish to receive from another, notice that. This is where you believe in a lack in yourself. Fortunately, the truth is that you lack nothing and that you are fully lovable. You are a divine child of God, created in the image of divinity. You could no more be lacking in anything that could God be deficient in any way. The idea is pure insanity, but it is that craziness that got you stuck in this illusion to begin with. Nobody forced you into this illusion. You are here by choice whether you remember the choosing or not along with your beliefs of lack, guilt and not being deserving of love. Your job is to notice that, be aware when limiting thoughts arise. Notice when you have the thought that another person can be your savior, can make you feel whole and complete. It would not be an easy job to change those thoughts you now have. Most likely that task is impossible. This outlines the coming major changes or explains why it is taking so long to be realized. The wait is for the awakening of the masses, for they cannot be convinced in any other way than by experiencing it for themselves. Meanwhile, planet Earth is on its way to its fifth dimensional position, which is a positive dimension for mankind, environment, food and happiness. 5D creates more jobs for saving and purifying planet Earth. There is nothing more than an illusion, like figures for value of shares or real estate. When you begin to recognize yourself in its way, it allows you to realize how in sync you are with your creator, with higher aspects of your being, with your body, your surroundings and other souls. There is a similarity between yourself and others that is such a sacred and pure truth. When the essence of the Creator is emanating from your being and is being allowed to be expansive and creative, you glow with radiance, with truth, with clarity, knowingness, grounding and understanding. I Archangel Michael which they invite you to focus your time upon blending your energy with the Creator. In recognizing and remembering your oneness with the Creator, there are many ways that this can be explored. You may already hold a deep connection with the Creator and be able to bring the Creator's energy forth through your being. If not, then ask within during meditation or quiet time, to seek the essence, the truth of your being that is the essence and truth of the Creator. As you ask of this, search within you for an inspirational moment, a light, 
a color, a sensation, or quality that connects you to the essence of Creator. Then, nurture this with your breath, allowing the radiance of the Creator to fill your entire being. You may also ask to experience complete oneness with the Creator. Remember always that your partner as well, as all other people, is your mirror, your project on them, what you believe to be true for yourself. Often, you do not wish to face these self-judgments, so it feels safer to project them on another while denying that it is about you. This is usually done unconsciously, that is why it is so important to look at every thought that enters your mind. If the thought comes that your partner can be so selfish, look at that. And selfishness is your belief. Don't fight it, don't try to change your behavior, simply observe and accept. Do not let a single projection live on without this kind of examination. As long as you deny this part of yourself and see it only in others, it will continue to be a painful and hopeless problem in your life. Your perfect love is you, as you truly realize that through accepting the perfection of you as you are, you will feel yourself engulfed in love with everyone you meet and every situation you encounter. Perhaps you may find yourself sharing your living space or your life with another. But this won't be because they are your perfect partner or because you feel a need for their presence to feel loved and completed. They will simply reflect or mirror the love you have for yourself. Today, more and more people around the world are waking up to this newly emerging reality and the understanding of what has been historically experienced, socialized, and taught to believe that the government is telling the truth, that not only are lies, but are only a poor cause of the outright mess of today. Real wealth requires real growth real savings, real investment, hard work, time, innovation, self-discipline, and all the other things that make the economy a powerhouse in the first place. 